Imagine harvesting a diverse array of fruits, vegetables and herbs all year round from a small space in your backyard. Welcome to the world of food forest polytunnels. This innovative approach to gardening mimics natural ecosystems in a controlled, compact environment. It's efficient, sustainable and perfect for maximizing the potential of smaller spaces. It allows you to grow more in less space and even tackle vertical crops like grapes. Stay tuned as we unveil the secrets to setting up your very own food forest polytunnel. First things first, choosing the right spot and the right structure for your polytunnel is crucial. You'll want to select a location that gets plenty of sunlight throughout the day, as this will be vital for photosynthesis. Protection from harsh winds is also important, as it can damage the polytunnel and the plants inside. Now, let's talk about setting up the polytunnel frame. Begin by driving the steel hoops into the ground at regular intervals. Once that's done, connect the hoops using horizontal bars to create a sturdy frame. The final step is to cover the frame with a polyethylene cover, ensuring it's tight and secure to withstand different weather conditions. Having set up the polytunnel, it's time to start planting. Think of your polytunnel as a mini forest with layers of vegetation starting from the ground up. The lowest layer is the ground cover, which includes plants like strawberries and herbs. Above that, we have the shrub layer, which can include crops like tomatoes and peppers. Finally, at the top, we have the tree layer, which provides shade and can include dwarf fruit trees like apples or pears. Don't forget to maximize your space with vertical growing techniques. Climbers like grapes are perfect for this. Train them to grow upwards on a trellis or along the inside of your polytunnel to make the most of your vertical space. With your structure in place, let's turn this framework into a thriving ecosystem. Now, the fun begins. Planting and watching your food forest come to life. To kick off, prepare your soil by enriching it with compost and other organic matter. This not only feeds your plants, but also improves soil structure and water retention. Planting in raised beds or mounds can enhance drainage and root health. When planting, think in layers. Tall fruit trees can form the canopy, while smaller bushes and herbaceous plants fill the mid and ground layers. This method maximizes both diversity and density, ensuring you get the most out of every square inch. Companion planting is your next secret weapon. By placing plants together that benefit each other, you encourage natural pest control and improve pollination. For instance, marigolds deter pests while attracting beneficial insects that help your vegetables. Maintenance is simple but essential. Regular watering, especially during dry spells, keeps plants vigorous. Prune to shape your plants and remove any diseased foliage. Seasonal adjustments might include mulching in autumn or applying more compost in spring to replenish nutrients. With these steps, your food forest polytunnel will not only thrive, but become a cornerstone of sustainable living at your home. All set up? Now watch as your garden becomes a cornucopia of fresh produce. Engage with your vibrant food forest, observing its growth and transformations. Each day brings a new learning experience. Dive into this rewarding gardening adventure, and don't forget to share your progress with us. Happy gardening!